I'm Wonderbeard Pirate here to guide you from vlog one to vlog many times. All that junk, all that trash can be something turned into something, a treasure or a joy forever. It's me, Wonderbeard the Pirate, Rain, 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 Rain. Here comes the sun, do 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 do. Here comes the sun, do 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 do. Here comes the sun, and I say it's all right, do 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 do. Little darling, I feel so do 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 do. Little darling, I feel so do 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 do. Here comes the sun, and I say. It's all right. Hi, folks. It's all right because here comes the sun. That's why I'm wearing these here uh, shades. Music by George Harrison. Imagine that, no? The quiet beetle and the most religious beetle of them all. See George Harrison. That's right, folks. Hello again. It's Wonder Bird the Pirate wishing you a great hello from beautiful Kansas City, Philippines. It's night time again, as you can notice. And as usual, we start from the beginning because we can start from the end. Okay, folks, we got lots of stuff today, lots of junk, lots of new items, and lots of advice to give you to take care of your stuff and make them displayed or appreciated. Like my long hair, like my long beard, fine. It's me, Wonderbeard the Pirate. Okay, got my sheets off so you can see my beautiful eyes. <laughs> now, we have some... Uh, items to feature to vlog you first until we get to our main feature which is a collection of something unusual but quite good okay so first things first our uh, our main uh, i mean to our supporting features okay look at this now from the japan surplus shop i got this uh, two wooden figures you see lit nila no two wooden figures of a man and a woman look at this he's got a beard just like me, but my beard is gray and his is black. Okay, black is black. I want my baby back to you. What can I do? Oh, what do you do? Ch -ch 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 -ch. Okay, look, anyway. Uh, Mahabigla umulan. Bagyoli, roli. Okay, now, what are these exactly? These are not just displayed items, no? Of uh, two wooden figures. You know what these are, Wonder Mates? These are uh, fertility icons. Huh? Fertility. Let's say a Japanese woman and a Japanese man, uh, they have no children after one year of marriage. So you, you put this nearby on your bedroom, naka display, or kahit sa bahay lang, any place in the house, right? Especially the bedroom. And pag naka display siya ganyan, uh, you, you must have faith because within a few months you're. Wife will become pregnant and you can have a baby soon. No? Fertility icons. These are the smallest. Eh? Pero kasi I, I have some that are really large. Huge. Also made of wood. Okay? Now, got this from the Japan surplus shop. Now, I know what your wonder mates are thinking. Huh? Wonder bird, uh, bakit nasa Japan surplus shop? Bakit yung dating may ari benenta? Well, your, your guess is a good, no? Uh, you know, pwedeng... Yung dating may ari nun ay nagkaanak na. Okay? So, they don't, they don't want to have any, many, many more children. So, they decide to sell it. Or, baka it did not work. Nakakalungkot naman yun. It did not work and then uh, the, the ones who owned it might as well gave it away to the Japan surplus shop para mabenta rito. Pero, I think it should work if you have faith. No? Faith and uh, prayer and hope and you will get your baby. Watch that, no? So, look at that, no? Nice uh, Japan's uh, fertility icons to help people, okay? Then, our next vlog feature is uh, about President Marcos, one of my favorite and most loved presidents. I also love President Duterte and many others, but one of the best is uh, President Marcos, okay? Now, look at this, no? I happen to have here a collection of stamps about President Marcos. Do you, do you see that? You see? Ayan, no? Ayan si President Marcos. Ayan siya. 
and here with Chiang Kai-shek, and this is Imelda, Imelda and Marcos. Right? This one features the inauguration of President Marcos on December 30, 1965 as President of the Republic of the Philippines. That's in 1965. By 1972, he declared martial law. I was in high school, okay? Then, uh, we have a solo picture here. Here we have uh, President Marcos and uh, Chiang Kai-shek of China. Am I correct? Let me read it. Uh, ah, yeah. It says uh, Chiang Kai-shek of China. It commemorates uh, more than 10 years of friendship of the Philippines with China, ng China. Then we have Imelda here as uh, she is profiled uh, about the about the International Women's Year. Yes. Now, of all these uh, stamps, uh, do I have a favorite here? Yes, I do. This is my favorite. No? Kasi ano siya, pormang porma si President Marcos. Inauguration of Ferdinand Marcos as President Republic of the Philippines on June 30, 1981. For the new republic, it was once called the new society. See, I was in college, okay? And uh, this one is about uh, Marcos helping the farmers and their children, okay? So that's it, no? If you happen to have stamps about a beloved person, you gather them and you place them in one album so that you could uh, look at these stamps, enjoy, and appreciate them, okay? Uh, what do you call that? Uh, the, the study and collection of stamps is called philately, and the person doing that is a philatelist. Pag coins, numismatist. Uh, don't forget that. Para siyang English lesson, huh? right? So, setting this uh, vlog feature aside, we now have the third vlog feature. Okay, I didn't get this from the junk shop. I didn't get this from Japan Surplus. I didn't get this. Uh, from the junkyard or any magbabote because I bought them brand new. Okay? Now, look at this, no? I, I bought them because it's a collection. Huh? You have to buy, you have to spend to, to create a collection. Okay, well, exactly about what? Collection of bottle openers in the form of soft drink bottles. Okay? Example, we have here this, uh, this Coke bottle. It's plastic. And we have the bottle... Tansan or crown opener. You see? There's a liquid in the I think it's water. And not only is it a bottle opener, it's also a ref magnet. You see? There's a magnet on the side. You can place it on the ref. Ooh, you can have your collection. Okay? Then, we have a Sprite bottle. You see? Green. I think it's 7-Up. Okay? Sprite. And then, we have this uh, San Miguel. San Miguel, uh, San Miguel uh, uh, beer. Bakit tinawag San Miguel light? Because when you say light, not because it's light, because uh, the calories are quite lower, so it's not fattening. In fact, you know, only this morning, uh, I saw an ad for San Miguel Zero. Completely no calories, no, just a wonderful taste. Okay, I, I haven't seen that. I haven't. Tasted that perhaps someday, okay? Someday you'll find that I have flown, but tomorrow will be, we'll follow the sun. Yeah, right. Then, for the next one, we have this uh, Mountain Dew. Okay, Mountain Dew uh, with the ref magnet also. Uh, also with liquid. We have last two. We have this San Miguel imported beer. Huh? San Miguel imported beer. Okay? It's not light, but regular beer, which is a strong beer. And finally, we have another one. San Miguel, uh, what's this? Uh, San Miguel premium beer. Wow, look at that. Huh? Green. So, in other words, this is a collection, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Nakalagay siya sa isang glass case or platform. So when people will visit your condo or your townhouse or your home, say, Wow, got the no, no, Wonderbird. You mean the bottle openers? No, the case, the platform. Oh, okay, fine, sure. Lagi naman ganun, di ba? Right. So I hope you can find something like this in the marketplace. Kasi I bought this sa Palengke. 
the marketplace. And this is 35 pesos each. Yun. Okay? I will come back maybe tomorrow to find out kung meron pang ibang soft drink bottles or beer bottles na imitation. Okay? Right. You know, may nagsabi sa akin, no? If you will drink soft drinks, do not drink soft drinks na may kulay. Sabi lang. Ha? You drink soft drinks na walang kulay. Therefore, we have Sprite, we have 7-Up. May walang kulay. Okay? That's what, that's what they advise me. Now, it's up. It's up for you. It's up to you if you want to follow the advice. Or just keep it in mind. Okay? Fine. So, I'll now put this aside. And now, we come to our main vlog, ladies and gentlemen. Diba? Let's say you have a... Uh, you say you have a, a, a soft drink. Now, what do you do with that soft drink if you want to mix it? You get a mixer. Pwedeng spoon, pwedeng long plastic for stirring it. They're known as stirrers. Okay? Stirrers. Now, would you believe I got this collection of stirrers from the junk men's cart? Magkakariton. Kasi nobody, nobody uh, shall we say, Gave them much value, but I valued them because uh, drink stirrer, and I got a lot of them. Okay, I'll, I'll show them to you. Okay, ito pa yung collection ko ng mga stirrer. Yeah, you, you see it? And dami no? Nice color, nice design. Later I will show you two of my favorites. Okay, but first we will introduce them one by one. Okay, we have this from the uh, from a hotel from the. Uh, it's a hotel. I can't read it, no? But uh, I think it says New World Hotel. Okay? Look at the balls dulo for mixing. Then we have this uh, Century Park Sheraton of Manila. You see, may tatak yun eh. You could mix it. Okay? Then we have this uh, uh, others. Just a minute, no? We have this uh, Green Patio Restaurant. You see, for steering. Okay, you have another one. We have uh, it, it. It has no name, pero y yung symbol lang. If you can identify that symbol, you're good. Because I have no idea. This one is says uh, the Manila Peninsula. Okay, the Manila Peninsula with the balls of dulo for mixing. You see, no two are alike, no. Pa iba iba. We have the Oceania Restaurant Ocean Terminal. Okay, I think this is in Hong Kong. See, my mouth didn't move. Hong Kong. You see? First, there's a telephone number so you can call them up and order some more items. No? We have the, uh, again, different version, the S, Century Park Sheraton. Imagine that. And then, we have the, uh, again, I can't, there are two horses, but I have no idea what this is, no? Maybe it's a horse restaurant. I don't know. Okay. And then we have this uh, intercontinental hotels. Wow, well, the intercon. See? For mixing drinks. Although I don't drink, but oh, it's cool. It's no problem. Oh, this one is quite simple, no? It's quite simple. It says uh, Stardust Hotel and Casino Las Vegas. Holy smokes. You pinaka simple, pa pinaka baganda, no? The Stardust Hotel and Casino, Las Vegas. Wow. Who knows? Baka Bugsy Seagulls might have used that. We have some more. We have the, the Manila Peninsula, another version. This one is, is brown. Just a minute. Uh, it says here, uh, Hyatt Regency Hotel. Look at the dulo. It's great in mixing. Imagine that. And then there's this uh, lion again. It says the uh, the Imperial Ho region, Imperial Hotel. I wonder where that is, no? Probably in Hong Kong. Okay. And then coming to the end, we have the Intercontinental Hotels. Okay. Uh, I think I, I said it already, no? And now I will give you my favorites. Okay. First is the Second place, we have the Manila Hotel. Wow, the Manila Hotel. Steerers. Did you know that when the Beatles came here in 1966, 
for a one-day concert. They stayed at the Manila Hotel. Imagine that, no? And when MacArthur came to the Philippines to, uh, for some relaxation and leisure, he went to the Manila Hotel. That's why up to now, there's still a suite in the Manila Hotel called the MacArthur Room or Suite. Okay, so second bed. Now, this is my favorite of all, the best, and I love it, no? We have the, the Playboy, the Playboy Hotel Steerer. It's a bit bent, no? Pasensya na. Because of the heat of the Philippines, no? So this one used to be used in the Playboy Club of Manila. Huh? The Playboy Club of Manila. You see, it's both high. Wow. Did you know that 007, Sean Connery, who recently passed away, was a member of the Playboy Club International. Meron siyang card eh. Imagine that. So this is the symbol of the, the, the Playboy Band is the symbol of the, of the uh, Playboy Club of Manila. You know, it's sad, no? Kasi I, I found out that the Playboy Club of Manila, I think it's already closed, no? And uh, they have been closing all over the world, no? In the States, I don't know kung meron pa, pero what can we do? That's, that's what it is, no? So try to have your own collection of steerers and other items, no? Kasi it's a form of stress buster, a form of display, and a form of collector's item, you see? Where can we find the most expensive steer in the world? It's probably made of gold from whatever, from the Transylvania Hotel, as you go to. Okay, so, okay, folks, so that's it for our vlog for this time. I will meet you again tomorrow. And uh, as usual, uh, please give me a good uh, like, a good subscribe, and please give me some comments, okay? Like, Wonder Bird! Uh, may collection ako ng mga shot glasses yung pang alak well that's good especially if there's a important celebrity on the glass like Elvis the Beatles or Marilyn Monroe or James Dean okay so with that I leave you again with my favorite expression that has guided me for many many decades okay folks huh okay right just remember folks that wherever you go you will surely be there. Bye. We love you.